This is a John Deere number 55 three bottom plow. It's made 1 16th scale by Speccast. And this is a pretty nice model. It looks excellent with any of the, uh, the John Deere Precisions, the Ertl Precision tractors from the 40s or 50s or even the 60s. I mean, these plows lasted a pretty long time. Uh, I think Speccast made two versions of this plow. One was hydraulic and one was not. This is obviously the hydraulic version. It's got the, the two lines here. Uh, it's also got a telescope and hanger here, which is pretty neat for the lines. Keeps them out of the dirt, keeps them from getting tangled around the drawbar or anything like that. Uh, also, you have a little hitch pin here, which is pretty neat. A little chain too, so you don't lose it. Uh, as far as functionality, the cylinder is fixed in place, which is a little unfortunate. It doesn't, uh, it won't raise up or down, which is. You know, like I said, disappointing. This does move, but it doesn't actually doesn't actually do anything, which is you know a little uh, a little disappointing. But other than that, it displays very well. The wheels are very well done. You know, the spoked wheels they look great. Uh, the plows and the the coulters themselves, they, you know, it looks great. All the linkages are in there, and like I said, it just it displays very, very well. It looks great with any of those tractors from the, the 40s or the 50s. And the, the hitch pin is really a pretty neat idea. I love that it's in there. It, it just it looks great. It displays very well. Uh, and Speccast just did an excellent job with this plow. Uh, overall, that's that's about it. Um, not a very uh, not a very complicated model, but it certainly looks it looks more complicated than what it is. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them. And as always, thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe to Maryland Construction Diecast. We do have some farm toys too. Thanks.